All right, hey collective, I'm back on here to come give you guys a general spread for today. Remember the spread that I'm pulling here is timeless, it's also general, so I need you guys to only accept the message. If it's for you, if it's not, leave it for the next person. Also, don't forget to hit the like or the subscribe button if you haven't already, come join me so we can grow the energy over here for you guys, all right? So we're gonna jump into this energy. I need for you guys to please tap into your intuition. Only receive the message if you know it's for you, all right? So the first card that flew out here for you guys is we have the Divine Feminine card. We have you broke the curse and we have clear your energy so i definitely feel like a lot of you divine feminists you broke some form of generational curse okay i'm definitely feeling like for a lot of you guys you are being guided right now to clear out your energy okay because you definitely could have toxic energies for a lot of you divine feminine that's trying to cause some form of interferences or blockages to a new start okay so a lot of you guys like i said for a lot of you divine feminists you broke some form of generational curse that's allowing you guys to have a new start okay make sure you guys are clearing out your energy because I feel like a lot of you guys could definitely have toxic energies that's trying to cause interferences or blockages around whatever this new start or new beginning is, okay? All right? Now, this could be an earth sign female for a lot of you guys that has been trying to create illusions, all right? This is someone who has been trying to sabotage a lot of you divine feminists who miss some form of opportunity, okay? So, for a lot of you guys, whatever this generational curse that you broke, I feel like someone has been trying to, you know, sabotage you guys from doing it, okay? They want you to miss some form of opportunity now this could have been someone who has been trying to do some form of confusion spell someone someone wanted you guys to be in doubt here okay all right um to try to block whatever this new start is okay but something has backfired here okay and i feel like whoever this is someone's very upset that something has backfired i feel like for a lot of you divine feminists this is multiple people who's upset here okay so make sure you guys are clearing out your energy because i feel like now you guys have energy who want to try to block this new start, okay? All right, because some form of uh, sabotage or whatever this was, they have missed some form of opportunity. They wanted you to miss it, but you didn't here, okay? All right, we have cycle ending, okay? So for a lot of you guys, I feel like whatever backfired on this person was, is something significant around a lot of you divine feminists holding back. So a lot of you guys could have... Um, did some form of, um, I don't know what this was. It's something significant about you guys not holding back that allowed you guys to break some form of generational curse, okay? So a lot of you guys could have released some form of energies. This could be anything, person, place, or thing, and it allowed you guys to have a new start here, okay? Um, we have the don't hold back, and we have the roles reversed. So I definitely feel like by you guys walking away or releasing something for a lot of you divine feminists, it switched the roles on whoever this is here, okay? Because for a lot of you guys, some form of illusions that this person or these people have been putting up has been broken because you guys made the choice to walk away and walk away and release here okay so for a lot of you guys it's some form of change that's about to happen for a lot of you guys this is some form of good news that's coming in for a lot of you divine feminists all right these are new doors that's opening up because you guys knew your worth about something here okay so make sure you guys are cleansing out your energy okay because look we have it will never work okay so i feel like for a lot of you guys and something about energetically, you could have toxic energies that's trying to block whatever this, this new opportunity, this new door that's opening up. But whatever it is that they're doing, it will never work here, okay? It's something about creating obstacle, obstacles for a lot of you divine feminists. But something, like I said, it won't work here, okay? It is balance being restored around a lot of you guys. Um, I definitely feel like a lot of you guys have, you know, energies that's still trying to interfere with this because something has back backfired in the past here so i feel like now energetically they're trying to have you miss the opportunity because they could not okay so it's something significant around there want you to self-sabotage this new opportunity um for a lot of you guys and i feel like they're trying to do this energetically okay but whatever it is that they're doing it's not going to work make sure you guys are staying grounded also and clearing out your energy okay all right so some additional messages that came out here is we have the secret competition now for a lot of you divine feminists whoever the this person or this people are okay um, for a lot of you guys this could be someone who feels like they're in secret competition around whatever this door that was opening up for a lot of you guys okay um, we have the ground your energy card that flew out here so something about you guys like I said make sure you are going out um, and grounding your energy going out in nature and staying grounded now this could be something significant about a lot of you divine feminists um, your success here okay this new opportunity or this good news could be regardless of form of success that's coming in for a lot of you guys all right we have the older water sign 
We have the older air sign that could be significant here. We have the letters M M C S J A F I N P Z X. Excuse me, that could be significant here. But look, we have the blockages removed, okay? So like I said, whatever it is that they're trying to do to block something for you, they're about to be removed here, okay? Um, I just feel like you have people that's very upset that um, they could not have you, um, you know, miss some form of opportunity. They couldn't sabotage for you, um, for a lot of you guys. So now they're trying to have you self-sabotage, okay? Um, and I feel like they're trying to do something energetically, but it's not going to work here, okay? Um a lot of you guys continue staying grounded at this moment here okay because a lot of you divine things you have good news that's coming in here okay let's see if we can get some um, additional messages for a lot of you guys okay yeah they, they, it's like somebody wants you to miss something here we have archangel Raphael. we have provider of healing for mind body and spirit here okay so a lot of you guys are working with archangel Raphael here okay all right so make sure you guys are meditating also here, okay? We have the uni unicorn. It says invite serendipity, okay? Yeah, it's something about you guys um, being in this positive type of energy, okay? I feel like this is what's coming in. Whatever this good news is, is definitely going to have you guys in like this, um, this um, you know, um, happy type of energy for a lot of you divine feminists, okay? All right. Like I said, I feel like we have Archangel Gabrielle out here. We have Messenger of Creativity and Hope, okay? So this could be something around you guys' creativity here, okay? Some of you guys could be some form of messenger here, all right? Um, but something definitely is taking off a lot of you guys, all right? I feel like you could have energetically having um, toxic energies try to affect your um, something to do with your something that you're creating here, okay? And like I said, I feel like these are um, energies that's upset that something did not work out here. Okay. All right. A lot of you guys. All right. We have Angel of Miracles. So it definitely is some form of good news coming in. Okay. All right. We have Open Your Heart and Inspect the Miracle. Okay. All right. So for a lot of you guys, it's something significant around you guys right now also working on your heart chakra. Okay. Okay, it's something good that's coming in. It's some form of miracle. And I told you, this is someone who feels like they are in some form of competition with a lot of you guys. We have the illusion card that was upside down here. Yeah, this is someone who has been um, in some form of secret competition with a lot of you divine feminists. Someone has been trying to put up some form of illusion to have you miss some form of opportunity. All right, we have embraced the truth. So for a lot of you guys, you could have got some form of truth here. Um, for a lot of you divine feminists, we did have the messenger of creativity. You could have spoke some form of truth, all right, that broke this illusion with this person here, this earth sign female here is what I'm picking up, okay? Something about you guys is um, self-confidence here also, all right? I feel like someone was very jealous of the confidence that a lot of you divine feminists hold. You guys got a new beginning, okay? You have a new beginning. It says begin your new life. So for a lot of you guys, this is something, a whole brand new life, a new opportunity that's coming in for a lot of you guys. Okay, it's a new beginning. It's a new start. Okay. And I feel like for a lot of you guys, like I said, someone definitely felt like they were in competition with something here um, that's, that was coming in for a lot of you divine feminists. Someone tried to put up illusions, but I feel like the truth got spoken here or got revealed here. Okay. So a lot of you guys, you got a new beginning coming in. And I feel like this person... Or these people are trying to, you know, interfere with you because of, um, I want to say envy for a lot of you guys, okay? All right. We have the star card. Yeah, some of you guys are about to step in this star energy for a lot of you divine feminists here, okay? We have miracles on this card also. It's some form of renewal of your energy is coming in also, okay? Right, what's the star energy for my divine feminines here? Okay, that's because you guys took a leap of faith. Okay, we have the full card out here. Okay, you guys took a leap of faith. Like I said, it's something about you guys taking a leap of faith and releasing and moving forward here. Okay, this is what brought in this new beginning because we have new beginnings on this full card also. All right, something about you guys taking a leap of faith on yourself. Okay, all right open up some form of new doors, some form of new paths 
for a lot of you guys. You took a chance on yourself here. Okay, and that's because, like I said, it's something significant about a lot of you divine feminists knowing your worth here. Okay, you took a chance on something. And I feel like this is what brought in this new beginning. We have the Empress energy and it always comes out for y'all. Okay, a lot of you guys are definitely standing in this Empress energy or this is what's coming in for a lot of you guys. We have the devil in reverse. Okay, all right. So this earth sign um, female could be in a Capricorn here. Okay, we have the devil in reverse here. Yeah, someone was definitely in some form of devil energy to have you miss some form of opportunity here. Okay. All right. Yeah, see, in, in the upright, it says toxic energies, obsessions, a, attachments, okay? Someone wanted you to be in some form of devil energy here, okay? Whoever these toxic energies was, this is how they were going to have you miss the opportunity, but it's in the reverse here, Okay. Yeah, a lot of you guys are releasing yourself from something, okay? Freedom, it says reclaiming power, release, okay? Leaving abusive, toxic situations, okay? A lot of you guys walked away from something that was a, was toxic here, okay? And like I said, that can be a person, place, or a thing here, all right? 11, 11 on the clock, all right? I feel like by you guys doing that, mm, we have 11, 11 that flew out here. Some of you guys could definitely be seeing 11 11 a lot. And I was just about to say for a lot of you guys, there's something about you guys walking away from some some form of faulty foundation and building a form of a firm foundation for yourself here. All right. And then the 11 11 card flew out here. Yeah, some of you guys are definitely um, moving towards something stable here. Okay. This could be a lot of you guys coming to union here. All right. For a lot of you divine feminists. All right. Some form of celebration. This is the good news that's coming in for a lot of you guys. All right. Let's see what else we can get out here. All right. We have the seven of swords in the reverse here. Okay. Yeah, somebody's getting caught here. Okay. Somebody's getting caught for trying to sabotage you. Okay. We have secrets. Okay. Yeah, somebody's getting caught here. All right, so this could have been an older air sign. Um, I'm picking up for a lot of you guys. This could have been an older um, earth sign Capricorn energy here. All right. Someone's definitely getting caught here, okay? All right, so we have the Ten of Cups, but it's in a reverse. Okay, we have family trouble, disconnection. All right, so this could have been like a family dynamic. This could have been a karmic family trying to do this here. All right. Unhappy home separation is coming up uh, for a lot of you guys. This could have been for a lot of you divine feminines, um, a couple here, a married couple. Okay. For a lot of you guys, something about these people could have been um, struggling. Okay. This is why they tried to have you self-sabotage something here. Okay. They could be having money problems here. All right. All right. And they try to come for you guys because you the, you in the Nine of Pentacles. Abundance, luxury, self-sufficient, self-worth, okay? Success, achievements. This is why someone has been trying to, um, something backfired, okay? So this could have been like a couple here, a married couple who have been trying to um, take away from you guys as Nine of Pentacles here, okay? They could have been trying to take away from your success, okay? A lot of you guys... I feel like this, you guys are receiving justice behind this, okay? A cycle is in and out. You guys are definitely receiving justice for whatever this, uh, whoever these toxic energies for a lot of you guys, okay? I also feel like you have toxic energies that's upset that you're receiving justice here, all right? We have the three of pentacles in reverse. So this could have been up to three people working together, all right? We have um, working alone, poor work quality, okay? ego competition lack of teamwork okay i feel like whatever this this is here okay i'm picking up a lot of you divine feminists this could have been like some form of cult or coven okay a dark coven that we're working together but i feel like whatever that was for a lot of you guys i feel like people are not working together anymore okay it's a lot of conflict because something backfired here okay all right Whoever, I feel like it's been up to three people here, all right? Yeah, something backfired with this group here. 
for a lot of you divine feminines, okay? And like I said, now I feel like they are trying to still energetically interfere with you guys because you're receiving justice around whatever they did. But it's going to backfire here. We have the three of swords in reverse, okay? We have release and pain, okay? Emotional and physical healing, okay? And we have self-love. Didn't I tell y'all it's something about you knowing your worth here, okay? All right? Someone wants you to be in some form of loss, grief, depression, okay, broken from something they were doing here, all right? It didn't work here, okay? You guys are receiving justice, all right? Around whatever it is that this person was doing here, okay? Let's see if we can get one more here. Yeah, look, we have the Ace of Pentacles. A lot of you guys are about to receive some form of justice, Okay, this could be some form of pinnacles coming in for a lot of you guys. This justice could be, I'm um, hearing like um, something old to you here. But you definitely have someone who felt like they were in some form of competition to take it away from you. Okay. This could be some form of new material, oper new job or promotion, a new opportunity. Okay. I feel like it's an opportunity coming in for a lot of you guys. This could be some form of manifestation. All right. So we're going to get out some zodiacs here we have virgo in reverse here okay so this um earth sign fem female could have been a capricorn or a virgo here we have libra okay all right we have an aquarius in the reverse here we have cancer here we have the sun card in reverse so this could have been someone you worked around this could have been co-workers here for a lot of you divine feminists we have earth in reverse here okay but this could definitely be an earth sign in reverse Okay, um, we have Pisces in reverse. All right, this older water sign could have been a Pisces here. Okay, I'm hearing the letter C, L also. Okay, we have water, could be significant here. We have Virgo again. Okay, C, we have Leo in the reverse. We'll get one more. We have Aries in the upright. We have water again in the re uh, reverse. So this could definitely have been an older water sign also. Okay, older earth sign for a lot of you guys. I'm also picking up older air sign here. All right. Three people working together here to try to take something away from you. All right. Um, and like I said, I feel like they're very upset right now that something didn't work. So they could be trying to energetically still try to be um, trying to interfere with a lot of you guys here. All right, they're trying to interfere with your happiness because we have the serendipity card that flew out here. All right, but it's not going to work here. All right, also I want to tell some of you guys, raise up your vibration here, okay? Raise up your vibration. I just feel like you guys have people that's very upset. They're projecting some type of energy towards you. I'm hearing an evil eye projecting here because you guys got a new beginning, okay? Some some form of new start. I'm picking up a lot of divine feminines. This is like some form of brand new life for a lot of you guys, for some of you. All right. Um, and someone is definitely upset about that. So let's see. Look at some angel cards out here. They're still trying to interfere. Okay. For a lot of you guys. I just seen the angel of knowledge here. All right. Yeah, someone is definitely. All right. We have angel of divine timing. Okay. So in divine timing, something definitely is changing for a lot of you guys here. All right. We have Angel of Meditation. So make sure you guys are meditating here, okay? Make sure you guys are meditating and clearing out your energy here, okay? Let's see what else we can get out here. All right. Also, I feel like people are very upset also around the um, knowledge that a lot of you divine feminines hold, okay? We have angel of clear audience. So some of you guys could be very clear audience, okay? Uh, we have an bullying pre prevention angel. So whoever this earth sign female is and whoever else is, you could have been dealing with some form of bullying from these people here, okay? This person could have been trying to bully you in some form of way, all right? Whoever this is here. All right. We have Angel of Good News. I told you guys, you got good news coming in. Okay. And this could be around some form of healing that a lot of you divine feminists did. Okay. But it is good news coming in. Okay. We have Angel of Enlightenment. Okay. 
Like I said, for a lot of you guys, it's some form of illusion has been broken. I feel like some form of truth came out. You could have been enlightened about whatever these people were doing here. Number 33, okay? All right? Some of you guys could be a master number 33 here, okay? I'm also picking up a cult or coven who has been interfering with a lot of you guys here. All right? Something definitely has backfired here. Let's see what else we can get out here. Something definitely backfired, and I feel like we have Angel of Clairvoyant, okay? Clairvoyance. All right. Yeah, I feel like a lot of, and look, we have Angel of Release. I told you guys, it's something about you guys trusting your intuition and walking away or releasing something that brought in a new beginning, okay? Some of you guys could have, um, be clairvoyant, okay? I feel like your spiritual gifts also brought in some form of truth, uh, around whatever this person has been doing or these people. Let's see what else we can get. All right, let's see. Any more messages for a lot of you guys? All right. We have the journey, but it's in reverse, okay? So for a lot of you guys, I feel like it's, Something about a lot of you divine feminine is your journey. I feel like these people have been trying to cause blockages on your journey. This came out, um, I got this message yesterday, but it's in the reverse here, all right? I feel like someone is upset that they could not block your journey here, okay? We have hidden in plain sight, okay? So for a lot of you guys, I'm definitely picking up. Someone could be definitely hidden in plain sight who has been um, trying to um, interfere with a lot of you guys here, Okay? I've been getting that hidden in plain sight message for a while now, okay? We have, look, multiple streams here, okay? So it's something significant about you guys, definitely. This good news could be some form of multiple streams of income here. Um, this could be some form of success here, all right? Yeah, that someone's very upset about here. All right, let's see what else. We have manifested magic. Yeah. Some of you guys, you manifested this, okay? You could have manifested some form of like a new opportunity or new beginning. So for a lot of you divine feminines, this is what's coming in here, okay? A lot of you guys could have manifested some form of success here, all right? Whatever this is for a lot of you guys, it's good news and it's coming in, okay? We have up updates to your system, okay? So a lot of you divine feminists could have definitely received some form of spiritual upgrade also when you broke this generational curse here. I'm also picking up a lot of you guys. You are definitely going through like some form of like um, receiving some form of upgrade right now, okay? Something about you guys taking time to rest here also, okay? Some of you guys are definitely receiving a DNA upgrade here, all right? Okay. We have queen of everything, okay? That's the empress energy card here. Yeah. A lot of you guys are stepping into that energy. See how this lady is sitting on her crown here. I mean, on her throne here, okay? Definitely our divine feminine, okay? You definitely are in this empress energy, or this is what's coming in for a lot of you guys, okay? Something you manifested is coming in, okay? Um, and like I said, someone could be trying to um, affect this here. Um, they want you to sabotage it, but it's not going to work. Continue trusting your intuition, okay? Continue trusting your intuition. We have the create, all right, and progress. So this could be something around your creativity, all right? Something about you guys keep moving forward, okay? Um, this could be some form of progress coming in around that also for a lot of you guys. We have the emotional baggage, and it's in the reverse here. Yeah, somebody wanted you to be... Someone wanted you to be in so much form of emotional, like... Um, I'm, I'm, I'm hearing for a lot of you guys like a mess here, all right? Someone has been trying to use emotional manipulation also to try to block you guys, but it's in a reverse, okay? All right? Someone wants you all tied up to miss some form of opportunity, but it's not going to work here, all right? So that's what I have for you, Divine Feminists. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to my channel. I will speak with you guys in a minute, and I love y'all so much. Bye.